was with Sid, but you know, if he isn't, doesn't play, I mean, just the adversity you have to face all year long with the next man up, you know, how much confidence does that give you going into this game that you'll be able to kind of overcome whatever the lineup looks like? Yeah, definitely. I think we've done it all year. We've always had that mentality, and um, this is just another, you know, another example of it, and we'll, uh, you know, we'll kind of take it from there. Thank you. Speaking of that, I mean, you guys have gone through a lot this season, and Coach Sullivan always talks about the leadership core bringing guys through things. Well, he's also one of the leaders. Just what what stands out to you about the job that he's done this season to get you through some of the things that you've gone through? Yeah, he's obviously a, you know, the best player in the world. He rises to the occasion, you know, whenever, whatever it may be. And, um, he's been incredible for us. Uh, there's really not enough good things you can say about him. And, um, you know, it's, it, it's a treat to play with him. Uh, Evan, it looked like you were working with that first power play unit. And obviously, no one's ever going to play sit in any capacity, but just what's your role in there? And how do you maybe slot into what those guys do? Yeah, you know, those four guys are all, you know, extremely skilled with puck and, and find open guys. And I think the key to, um, to success on that power play is just kind of having that five on five mentality, winning puck battles. And then, you know, once you get possession, that's when. You know, you kind of just let your natural ability take over. Um, you know, and then just try not to be too cute with it. Trying to shoot the puck early, and then you know, letting things kind of kind of come to me after that. Yeah. Evan, there's a difference sometimes between mindset and approach. Your mindset, I'm sure, is not changing as you mentioned this game, but your approach, I'm wondering about because you're the guy that got bumped into the first power play, and you're the guy that moves into the top six. Does your approach for the game change? Does does that happen? No, I think. Um, you know, I think when you do that, that's when you get in trouble. When you try to change the way you play and try to change your game, um, you know, when you get bumped up the lineup, um, I think that's when you get in trouble and, you know, try to be too cute and stuff like that. So for me, it's just, you know, making the hard plays, being simple early and, um, you know, not kind of chasing it, letting the game come to me and, you know, continue to play the way I've been playing uh, the first five games.